We're gonna get a few of these guys. They're gonna crush them. So the grouper's probably gonna see it right now, and he ate it. And he got it. Oh my God, he's gonna clap it, he's gonna clap it. Oh my God, oh my God. What is going on guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be feeding our predatory tank back here. We got our grouper and our eel in there. I'm gonna make this intro short. So let's run to Barrier Reef, get some live damsels, and see if we can feed these guys. Remember to hit the subscribe button if you're new here, turn that post notification bell on, and of course enter our giveaway by doing, subscribing, the post notification bell on, liking this video, and then double entry, of course, follow us on Instagram. So let's just hop into the video and get right to it. All right guys, we are at the Barrier Reef, and just wanted to say, I love this fish right here. Look at that pink on him. That's an awesome fish. He will be in our community 125 one day. Oh, there they are. Here are the damsels, by the way, guys. This is what we are going to be getting for our grouper and our eel. They love to eat live fish, and um, this just works for them. This is just something small that they can, you know, feel like predators with. So we're gonna get a few of these guys, and uh, they're gonna crush them. Like they probably will. I hopefully they will get them in this video, but sometimes at night um, they'll come out and just wreck, wreck. Feeding them live every once in a while, it's good. Keep their spirits up, make, keep them happy instead of just giving them dead food all the time. So we're gonna get some of these damsels right here. We're gonna show you guys just how absolutely savage our eel and our grouper is. They are absolute psychos. So let's get these guys bagged up and bring them back to the house. Also guys, one quick thing. Let, it, let us know down in the comments if you guys like triggers because we were thinking about getting one in our 125 predatory because um, they can go in there with them. Maybe a, cl a big clown trigger, but let us know if you guys want to see a trigger like this in our tank and uh, if you guys would like that and what kind of trigger you guys would see. I don't know. There's a bunch of different kinds of trigger. You got a clown trigger. That one was a pink tail trigger. So let us know down in the comments if you want to see one and what kind. This mini artist usually hides, but look. Look, look, he's pissed. He's pissed. He, he will get you. Oh yes. my god, dude, this thing's a psycho. You. That is like our, that's like the one we have at the house. Holy cow, he darted right up, look. Chris. Dude, and this guy's got teeth. This big guy's got fat teeth, man. Dude, he wants to eat, dude, he wants to eat. That thing is sick. All right, guys, we got the damsels in there. That's our food. Almost gonna crash my car, because I'm not looking at the road here, but uh. <laughs> Got our damsels, let's go feed our savage fish. We are back, as you know, this is our 125 gallon tank, looking as beautiful as ever. Look at this tank. Look how beautiful it is. And this is what we have in here. There's our Miniatus in the back. He'll come out in just a second once he smells the food. And our eel has been hanging out right there in the back here. The last day or two, he's been right there with his mouth open. And um, what we have here, is what we usually feed them, tilapia, but we like to get them stirred up a little bit with some live food, make them feel like they're in the wild, you know, get, keep them happy. But that's what's gonna get them woken up a little bit. You put a li I swear, you put a drop of this tilapia in here. If we drop it in, the eel will smell it and he will come out looking for it, swimming around all over the place. So we're just gonna drop this guy, in, this one piece in, just to let it ferment and let everything, you know, Start smelling this. The grouper's probably gonna see it right now, and he ate yeah, it. Yeah, he got it. Grouper ate it right there already. So, all right, let's get one more piece in there. We gotta get this eel going a little bit because he is psycho. Oh, he smells it. He smells it? Yeah, he's out. There he is. The second baby piece in there. That's what we want. And see our eel in the back? He's already freaking out. That's, of course, thankful that we have these lids because he's already trying to get out all the time. And, uh, that's what happens when he smells food. He just starts creeping everywhere, and in a second, he'll, he'll start going crazy. There's the grouper that already ate, but we gotta get these damsels in here because they're absolutely going to smack them, and it's going to be sick. There's the eel, look at that thing. Look at this thing, guys. Look how sick it's that so eel is. is. I'm sorry. He gets really pissed when he smells food. The grouper's just chilling in his rock, and that thing is hungry right now. He really, really wants to eat, and he definitely wants one of these damsels right here. So we actually got Three damsels, but two of them are alive. Our buddy Daryl, he gave us one that was dead already, that was in the tank, so that we could just feed him on a stick. We wanted to see this, the eel eat the damsel right off the stick. So Daryl gave us one that was already dead. It's a blue, a blue and yellow one. So we'll get that thing up on the skewer right now, and we're gonna show you guys that this thing is going to destroy it. All right, so be ready. All right, you guys, there are our two live damsels right there. Chris has the dead one on the stick. 
that damsel, guys. This right thing there. He's gonna get destroyed. He's gonna get waxed. Let's throw him in here. Where is the eel coming? Okay, there's the eel. I'm gonna bring him out for you guys. Okay, yeah, try to get him out and I'll try to get a good shot of him. Once this eel sees it, he's gonna eat it whole. I'm telling you guys, he's gonna it, munch it's it in a vacuum. One bite. It's, it's a vacuum. It's insane. I'm gonna try to get the eel out, let okay. him see this. I'll do my best to get a good shot. Oh, there's the eel. Okay, he he definitely he definitely sees it. He definitely smells it. Okay, good. Okay, okay. he's gonna come out. I'm just trying to get him up close to the glass. Come on, buddy. You want this? You want this, bro? Get over here. Come on. <laughs> get over here, dude. Come on, buddy. I'm telling you, one bite, he's done. All right, yeah, it's pretty good. Watch this, guys. Watch this, guys. Watch this. Ready for this? You gotta work for it, buddy. You gotta work for it. <laughs> come on. He, he thinks it's alive. Got it. Oh. oh, come on. Here he goes, here he goes. I think it's too far up on the skewer. That grouper wants to eat him right now. He's lowered on the skewer, he's here lowered on the skewer. Here we go. This damsel, yeah, we're focused up. Come on. Here he goes. Here he comes, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes. Here he goes. Here he goes. Here what? <laughs> you guys, seems to be running in the barbs bam right now that everything's just camera shot. Everything's camera shy. The damsel's on hold right now. Yeah, the damsel's on hold. The eel does not want to eat it, so we're gonna try putting on a little bit, a little piece of tilapia to see maybe if that's what he wants. Maybe that damsel has just been dead for so long that maybe it just barely has any more scent left in him, so we're gonna try feeding him just a little piece of tilapia just right there. Just, just maybe he just needs something that smells a little more. He just doesn't want to eat. Oh, there he goes. He See, snagged he it. He that. smacks that. He crushes that. It's already gone. He All already right, smacked so it. So now that he's a little... Maybe maybe shy. now he will want to uh, eat the damsel. But by the way, guys, I told you guys that it would, we'd announce it last week. But it's going to be today. And we are naming the eel Yeti. I think it had like almost 30 likes. Yeti, we love the name. That's going to be his name. And uh, what, a, what a sick name. All right, guys, it's the next day. Grouper's a little lively right now. I think he wants to eat. He's been looking at me this whole time, but he's actually out. As you can see, he's not hiding a rock. We're gonna try a live damsel first, okay? That was a live damsel right here in my finger, right here, okay? So we're gonna try it right here. See if we'll eat it. Oh my God, he's gonna clap it, he's gonna clap it. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> Oh my god. Guys, when I tell you that that thing is a monster, oh my god. Did you guys see that? I really hope the camera got that. That was insane. Oh my god. You think we give him another one or you get to the eel? Jack's gonna be pissed we didn't. Guys, we didn't wait for Jack to see this. He's been wanting to see this. I think we gotta wait for, for the next one. Oh my god, he's pissed. That was absolutely nuts. I mean, he actually destroyed that anvil. So uh, if I don't spook him because I don't want to move too quickly, I'm gonna try to get him another one. Okay. We only have one more. We were gonna give one to the eel, but that was awesome. Let's just see right now if he will eat again right here. Ready? I'm gonna show it to him again. Bring it up here. It looks like he's hungry again. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see if he'll eat it. Oh my god, man, he, he wants it, he wants it, he wants it, he wants it. He definitely wants it, it's just hiding. No! The damsel got away! Guys, the damsel got away, that's a smart damsel. He hid right in the rock, but now the eel's looking at it. The eel's looking at it right now. Right in there, that's where the damsel swam. All right guys, that is gonna be it for today's video. This leaves some more room open, guys. These are just getting warmed up to us this week. So imagine in a couple weeks when they're all ready to smash some fish. So that just leaves the door open for a, another feeding video, but when they're super hyped. So we're gonna keep getting them super warmed up to us and ready to go. So probably in a week or so, when we post another one of these videos, it's gonna be epic. These fish are gonna be flying out of the tank for, for food. So just stick with us, because these fish, just like our flower horn, he took like almost two to three weeks to get warmed up to us. So that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that grouper smashing that damsel. I thought it was awesome. We're going to feed him a bunch of stuff like shrimp and uh, other fish, pilcher, whatever we find. We'll feed him. So uh, that is it for today's video. And guys, do not forget to enter into the giveaway. So hit that subscribe button, turn that post notification bell on, and uh, follow us on Instagram for a double entry for a chance to win our 
giveaway. And also, do not forget to smash that like button. Let's get this video to a thousand likes. This grouper is a beast. If you love this grouper, hit that like button, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace. What did you just say? Tio! <laughs> it's on video, too. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> That's who wrote again. Seen a dandy down down. Yeah. Song in a week. Okay.